This is something that's been on my to-do list for over a year. This is the modification to recalibrate the 126 speedometer when you fit the aftermarket AMG face plates that go up to 300 kilometers per hour. This is the factory calibration of 75 ohms. I'll have a link in the description to the original Benzweld thread where this is discussed. This is not my discovery, this is quite old. So this factory 75 ohm resistor is now set at 100 ohms and this is what the person in the thread suggested as a good compromise for the 300 km per hour speedo face. I'm actually just going up in 100 hertz in increments so you can see that um, it does overall change the speed readings. It's not just in one place that it's changing it. Just to demonstrate something mildly interesting, on this particular version speedo mechanism, I think it may be out of a Gen 1, um, it absolutely will not display more than 250 kilometers an hour, regardless of the calibration. Um, this does not uh, seem to be the case on the updated speedos that I have here. Those will display whatever the hell you input into them. They go well past 260 on the factory face. Whereas this one just will not go above 250. I think it's the mechanism itself. Um, the needle's just collapsing at any frequency above 250 kilometers an hour. So if you have this early version speedo mechanism in your 126, I don't think you're going to be displaying 300 kilometers per hour. Not at least on this version. The updated speedo mechanism seems to display it fine. And even with this mechanism connected to the later version board, it still doesn't go above 250, so I'm not sure what's going on there. It must be something in the actual mechanism itself. So that location there where I've got these two connections soldered in is where the factory 75 ohm resistor is installed on the generation 1 speedo. This is the updated generation 2 with low component count and this has the updated IC and that's also the 75 ohm resistor location. It's basically in the same place. And I'm going to wire this one up now and give this one a go as well. And this is at 75 ohms, the factory setting. I'm now changing it to 100 ohms. This is, if you will imagine, it now having the 300 kilometer an hour speedo face and you want to slow down that needle. As you can see, at the initial step of 100 hertz, it's now reading considerably slower. That's 200. That's now 300 hertz. Of interest, let's now push this early version mechanism as far as it will go with the updated um, Gen 2 board. See, even though the board has the 100 ohm resistor, which lowers the speed reading of the needle, it still will not go past this point, which presumably is like 250 kilometers an hour. I'm not sure what the hell's going on there. This is not a project I recommend for those that aren't familiar with electronics. This um, speedo assembly has to be completely torn apart just to access this resistor. So you have to take the board out and then desolder the mechanism off the board. And then you have access to the resistor. So that's a lot of work just to get to that resistor and hope for the best that you've chosen the correct value at the end of the day.